we are heading towards the big conference in Rio de Janeiro in June, and we're now here at the Planet Under Pressure Conference. I would be interested to hear how you see that fits into the sequence from Stockholm, Rio, to the Rio Plus 20 conference. Yes, I think we're celebrating today, the, uh, or, or this year, the uh, 40th anniversary of Stockholm and the 20th of Rio, and we have the Rio Plus 20 now. I believe that uh, there is a sequence. Stockholm represented the first big UN conference on the environment with the interest mainly on national and regional environmental problems. Then came uh, Rio, uh, which introduced development aspects in the whole problematique. And also we realized that there were uh, now uh, immense natural systems that we were affecting, namely in particular climate and biological diversity, uh, ecosystem services and so on. And now we have with this conference here in uh, London, we are talking about the, what is known as the Anthropocene, that is that we live in a new epoch when mankind and man collectively has an impact on all these uh, enormously big systems. and. We want to make here an impact on the Rio Plus 20 conference to make it another step on the road to a better governance and better awareness of the global environmental problems. If you compare the situation now for the Rio Plus 20 conference to the previous one in 1992, what, what stands out as, as being very different? Well, I think there is a, a concrete difference and that is of course that the Rio conference in 1992 had before it could could benefit from the uh, Brundtland Commission report which was a really of great importance and also a very strong secretariat uh, and uh, there were preparatory committees working for weeks and so on now this conference is mainly a, a short uh, summit meeting of course but there will also be other activities and the preparation has been of a different character. And that's also why I think that it's important what we are doing here at the Planet Under Pressure Conference to support uh, the work in Rio de Janeiro in a couple of months. Um, you said in, uh, in Stockholm it was the national governments that were central. In Rio we had uh, big treaties that were being signed. How would you typify Rio plus 20 in that regard? I would uh, feel that Rio plus 20 will have to carry us over into a, a new period when there are new relationships also in the world. And I think in particular of the in increasing importance, of course, of countries like China, India, Brazil, etc. Uh, it's uh, obvious that 